I've got $500 and 30 minutes to make a more epic Pokemon card binder than this guy. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Unlisted Leaf, aka Ando, and I'm about to destroy the Pocket Monster in our first ever challenge. Wait, I didn't, I didn't tell you to say that. I've got to win no, this challenge. No. That's right. Ando from Unlisted Leaf and I are about to dupe it out. It's Team Unlisted Leaf versus Team DPM. Speedbinder challenge in three, two, one, go! All right, so we're here at the Hawaii PopCon and there are so many vendors here, it's so wild. I've never had a chess mount before and I think this is an absolute game changer. What if we skip the cards and we buy this? The biggest Psyduck of all time. And I got some ideas. I got some ideas. Okay, here's the deal. Whoever loses has to hand over their binder to the winner to give away on their channel. The last time I lost the challenge, the binder, and my pride, but I'm not gonna let that happen again. Oh, and the winner also gets $500 to add to the giveaway for their subscribers as well. The question is, who's gonna decide who the winner is this time. Hey everybody, I'm Sarah and Adichani, the voice of Ash. Catch him on Pokemon. That's right, it's Ash. I mean, Sarah, the voice of Ash. And her favorite binder is gonna be the winner. But she's not gonna know whose is whose because both binders look exactly the same. And right before we started, both Ando and I had 30 seconds to ask Sarah some questions. What character do you enjoy the most playing on Pokemon? Ash or what Pokemon? Oh. Not Ash Ketchum, no, no, no. Ash oh, fine. Buneary. Okay, Sarah, what's your favorite Pokemon? Pikachu. Pikachu, do you like vintage Pikachu or newer Pikachu? Vintage Pikachu. What is something that you've stolen in the past? Stolen? Yep, stolen. I want to know, I want to know. Because to be honest, that's what this video might resort to. I stole a dolphin-shaped pencil sharpener. She, guys, hashtag exposed right there. Three Pokemon that you've voiced before. Baneri, Chansey, and what's another one I like? Oh, Wingull. What is the perfect first date? <laughs> March 20th. <laughs> oh. Would you prefer heaps of cards, but yeah. they're not as good? Or like just a few really good cards? Just a few really good cards. Oh, I should have asked that last time. All right, so I've got a final last question. Wait, wait, Pat, this is so important. Oh my God. I have less than 30 minutes remaining, which means I have to figure out which direction I want to go with this binder. First, I stop at this vendor with Owen. He's an absolute boss who helped me in my Evolving Skies Challenge video. And oh yeah, right off the bat, the Lost Origin Pikachu V with Ash. I'd like to buy that Pikachu right there. This is like the perfect card to start with for the voice of Ash Ketchum. And then I see it. Actually, a gold 25th anniversary Pikachu promo. And yeah, I need this. So let's pick up those two. And just like that. 75. My first pickups. Let's go. Owen, you're awesome, Owen. We're going to start off the binder with Ash and Pikachu right in the center. And then we're going to go from there. Pretty good start here, but I wonder how Ando's doing. All right, Psyduck. Not today, bud. Oh, what's that? Team Rocket Dex. No, I'm getting singles. We're getting singles. She loves the trainers and I think she loves the really cute stuff. So I would personally love to get the Tyranitar, but it's not for me. So, oh my goodness. Why is this video not for me? Bright, cute, colorful. See, that's a custom card. That is awesome. Oh my, 10 bucks. I feel like she'd love it. It's so cute and colorful. Like that's the start of the binder. Oh, this is great. Ash Ketchum. Yep. You know, I might look around, but I'll get these two right here, I think. Old school prisms. Yeah, I've got Pat's card. We could go buy a Toyota Prius after this. <laughs> Five minutes since my first pickup and I'm struggling to find anything. Army. Oh, I found a shiny. Bunnelby. Sarah said she voiced Bunnelby, right? A Baneary. Flipping through, I find another one, and these are pretty cheap. Oh, that was such a good pickup. Two Bunnelbys for $7. Thank you so much. They're cute, but this isn't what's going to seal the win for me. I want a couple big hitters. Um, I'm not exactly sure what I want to do. Sure what I want to do. Sure what I want to do. Like, oh, okay, okay. Really need to find some Skylars. Oh, she loves Mew. Pikachu, she loves Pikachu as well. With these shining ones, I'm going to do like a whole page character rares. Oh, Eevee, there we go. Awesome, thank you so much. Oh, there's Skylar. Do you have Skylar in a raw form at all? No. No, that's okay. Hey, we're on the over at this table, holy buckets. Was Team Rocket up in here or something? Anyway, I start flipping through this vintage binder and then all of a sudden, ooh, lots of chances. Another Pokemon that Sarah voiced. I pick up three Chansey Hollows from three different sets, flip through another binder. Dude, look at all those Kangaskhans. It's like a Kangaskhan convention. It's enough slices! Anyway, let's grab these three Chanseys and wait, I see something. And this pink Pikachu down there. A full art Pikachu from Vivid Voltage. This is a gorgeous card and I'm super lucky to have just found it right now. Like about 75. Quick transaction later, and boom. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. The pink Pikachu was super clutch, but you know what would make this even better? The rainbow Chonkachu from the same set. If I could find this card, I mean, we definitely have a Chan C to win. Bruh. I'm sorry. I just, I sometimes just, wait, what's going on over here? Guys, what are you doing? Are you helping wait, them out? Wait, 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 wait. We're going to tune into Ando's Iron Man cam to find out what's going on. Oh my gosh. Okay, I need to go. Meanwhile, I like your binder. So you're looking for Pikachu? Yeah, Pikachu's would be good. Oh no, my man. What do we uh -huh. got here? Okay, okay. This is what I need. $10, I'll take both of them. $10 for both? 
What do you reckon? This is a really nice card. $20 for this one? $20 for that one, yeah. All right, man, there we go. Nice, <laughs> nice. We saw Pat, and he looked like he was stressing. That's a good sign. Okay, we have $343 left. Um, hold up, hold up. I found it. The Motherload. The Monk Scream Pikachu promo. This card would absolutely seal the deal. How much for the Scream Pikachu? $2,000. 2000 <laughs> Oh my gosh, raw? Two grand is a bit outside of my budget. So unfortunately, I'm gonna have to pass on this one. Bye, Pikachu. Next, I roll up to this vendor and call the fire department. These are insane. And those are insane. Yeah, this table's way too rich for me right now. Yo, hey. Hello. It's Ian with Ian, who may have been conspiring with Ando earlier. What, what did Ando tell you? We called Pikachu. Oh. <laughs> we gotta find some cards right now. Huh? But then Ian comes back and to make it fair, offers this Pikachu EX Blackstar promo. That's actually really cool. How much would you want for it? 20. Okay, yeah, yeah, we'll do it, we'll do it. Thanks guys, yeah. appreciate it, thank you. And yeah, I guess we could still be friends. We have 10 minutes left. I wanna find one banger card. What would be an expensive Pikachu that I could get for 320 bucks or something? I don't know, but I better find something soon or else I'm gonna lose this thing. Oh my goodness. Look at all of this, this is ridiculous. Holy smokes. Oh, Skylar, bang. How much are these ones? Here we go. Oh, no way, I'll get both Skylars. We'll get one Mew. Right, let's get the two Mews. Oh, this one's great. I'll grab the Poke Kit as well. Got the Mew EX, how much is it for? Yep, chuck it in. Oh, no way. We got the three Mews right there. And then under it, we got three Mews, so we just need two more of those. Oh, EVV Max. Oh my goodness, look at this thing. It's Charizard season. Oh, we're not looking for Charizards. Got the Eevee, three of these EVs to start the top page off, and then I reckon they evolve Jolteon under it, and we're gonna go VMAX Jolteon, I reckon that's what we want. Oh, yes, full art, unreal. Look at all of this. How much are these ones? Uh, 40. Oh, maybe pushing the budget. Actually, no, I think it's right. Let's go, let's go one of those. Nice training gallery. I'm gonna get two more gold Pikachus, maybe. Yeah. Surfing, surfing. Surfing, yep, let's do that. Hawaii edition, guys, eh? Aloha. And then we just need to go buy two more gold Pikachus if we can find it. Oh my gosh, is this gonna blow the budget, guys? Oh my gosh, I got seven minutes. Total? Yep, what's the total? 1,500. No, no, that's way over budget. What are we dealing with here? 208, maybe 180. Deal, let's do it. Thank you very much. Oh my gosh. Sorry, sorry, excuse me. Five minutes left and I'm totally frazzled. I haven't found anything. Let's take a look. I'm flipping through what feels like my hundredth binder today and then all of a sudden, Ooh, we might have to change our strategy. Look at these, these are sick. Topps Pikachus are pretty awesome and they look more like the anime than the other cards. I, th I think these are gonna be it. Alrighty guys, we're literally, we are hunting to a lost origin. Hey, how you doing dude? I need golden Pikachus. I grab a couple Pikas from the binder and then flip through to see if there's anything else. Oh. More Pikachus. Okay, I'm just gonna grab a bunch of these. I've got enough in my budget and then I see this page. Oh, I wish I was a full page. That would be so cool. Yeah, but come on dude, you're running out of time. It's time to check out. That guy's busy, that guy's busy, that guy's busy. Oh no, it's not looking good. Why is Chunky Choo so popular? It. What do you mean you sold it? You're supposed to wait for Ando to show up. Any Skylar cards? Yeah, let's take that. $80. Yeah. There we go. Finally, I was able to get some help and I checked out for $85. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Ah! Any raw cards, any raw cards. I'll grab the uh, Ash card. Two Pikachus, that's what sign us off. 15. Oh, I don't know. I'm not confident about this at all, but I'm going aesthetically pleasing. Right, I got $238 left in like three minutes. Oh, man. Wild. With just a couple minutes left, we're on our last chance. It's gonna happen with this guy right here. Um, no way. How much would you go for this? The Rainbow Chonkachu, it's in my hands. I don't know, I just got it. <laughs> no, he doesn't want to sell it. This man could make or break the entire video. <laughs> I mean, what would you offer on this? Uh, I would offer $238. Come on, dude, this is a good deal. I'm giving you way more than it's worth. Okay. Yeah? yeah? Oh, bro, bro, thank you. Right as the event was announcing the two o'clock ban. Okay. Yeah? Unbelievable. And we finished the challenge with zero dollars remaining and the rainbow chonk chew. Even though I know I overspent on that. Let's see how Sarah likes it because it's rainbow. It's a banger card. After that, Ando and I both spent some time to arrange our cards in our binders. And before we knew it, it was time to hand over the binders to Sarah and have her decide which of these is the winner. Oh! It's Ando's binder, and what a reaction from Sarah. Oh! 
I look at Ando and he looks just as worried as me. This is a beautiful presentation, I will say that. Oh wow, oh my, my, my. An entire page of Pikachus with the Radiant Collection Pikachu from Generations. That is such a great card. And look at all those Mews on the other page. Uh, Overall impression? I love it. Final page, Eevee and Eeveelutions. This is great. All right, Ando, you've put up a good binder for sure, but how's it gonna fare against my binder and the Rainbow Chonkachu? I didn't even see any cards worth more than that one in your binder, but again, value is in the eye of the beholder. And right now, that is Sarah. Not bad, not bad. Okay, my binder is up next. Here it comes. Your next I binder. Okay, this one is a single. That's good, that's it, that's the whole thing. I wanted to start slow and then build up. And I mean, come on, this card is so beautiful. It doesn't need any distractions. This is gonna be a hard choice. This is perfect, something different, hopefully meaningful. Nice presentation as well. Then she pulls out a Chansey to take a look at. The edges are not good. Wait, wait, she's looking at condition now? Oh no. Not a professional, but I mean, it <laughs> doesn't take much. Don't know what the Bunnelbees are about. That's a strange choice. Wait, wait, hold up. Didn't she say she Pretty voiced cool Bunnelby? You've voiced before. Baneri, Chansey, Baneri. <laughs> Also a, a Tom's Pikachu. I think we have the same one in here. Wow, she's taking this very seriously. That's good. Yeah, you guys both chose this Tom's Pikachu, except this one is a hollow. Same Tom's Pikachu, but mine was a hollow. That's a plus one for me, it seems, but it's not over yet. And then on the next page, there he is, Rainbow Chonkachu. Very tough choice, you guys. Wait, where's the reaction? This card is amazing. That is my favorite card. At least Ando loves it. All right, Sarah, you got binder number one, this first is a one. Really fun one too. Or binder number two. Oh my god. I can't like mix and match. Oh, this is so tough. You can't do this to me. <laughs> I'm getting super nervous now, and it looks like Ando is too. I can't lose this two times in a row. You gotta pick one. I gotta pick one. You gotta pick one. Oh no! Oh no! I lost again. I can't believe it. What really sold it for me was these three Skylas. The Skylas. Did the you Skylas. ask something? No, no, I know she voices. Star. I did my best though, and I'm proud of that. But because I lost, that means that the losing binder actually goes over to Ando to give away on his channel. And yep, he also gets $500 to spend to give away on his channel too. Thank and you so much. Thanks Ando, appreciate you. Say thanks Bye. to Sarah. And thank you for watching. And make sure you subscribe because hey, we might make a binder for you one day.